There is a day set aside to highlight the benefits of joining a credit union and what they can offer. Today is International Credit Union Day, and there's a local credit union that wants to feed you some free food. Joining us in the studio to talk more about it, we've got two center, manager, center managers for Community Choice Credit Union, Ethan and Courtney. Hello, Courtney. Hi, Ethan. Good morning. Good Thanks morning. for being here. Thanks Pre for having us. Happy International Credit <laughs> Union Day. When I read this, I think international? Is that really an international event? Or I, I always think of credit unions as, as an American thing. Yeah, so uh, there are 394 million credit union members around the globe from Asia, Europe, Central America, South America, North America, you name it. Uh, and they hold about $3.84 trillion in assets around the globe. So it is definitely an international thing. Yeah, if you thought that credit unions were just these small little, I mean, that's trillions of dollars we're talking about, Ethan. And, well, the cool thing about a credit union versus a bank, we should start there, and then we can talk about all the free food you're going to give us. <laughs> what do you think? <laughs> What's the difference between banking with a traditional bank versus a credit union? Absolutely. So we'll just simplify it into two words, get versus give. Uh, everything that a bank's going to be doing is going to be on the analytical side, right? What do they get back? If they invest in the community, what, what analytically are they getting back from that? Sure. Or on the credit union side, we're nonprofit. It's all about give back. What we get, the more assets that we have, the more that we invest, like the food trucks that we're going to talk about today. Mm -hmm. We've got backpack drives. We've got volunteer hours for our team members. Uh, just this year alone, we have over 400 team members, and we've committed to over 10,000 volunteer hours in the state of Michigan wow. in our local areas. So. That's really the difference for us. It's get versus give. So you get what well, we get, you give. Yes. Uh, from a credit union. Courtney, tell me about this party. What are we going to do? Yeah, so we're so excited to celebrate International Credit Union Day. It's 75 years, so we're going big this year. <laughs> we're going to have food trucks at every single one of our locations, which it's 24 across the state of Michigan. So any location that you visit today, you'll be able to stop by and get some food. Uh, you can even go to multiple locations to try out what we've got if you want. <laughs> Why not? I mean, make it a tour, a little food tour exactly. of credit unions, right? And, uh, do we know what's being served and uh, we're bringing cash for this or are you just feeding us on your dime? No, we're feeding everybody completely for free. We just want you to come and stop and step by, check out the member center, uh, bring your neighbors and your friends and your co-workers and your kids. These are locally owned businesses supplying this food, right? Too, This isn't like some national thing. This is like we're, we're supporting local food trucks. Absolutely. So at every, every community that you visit, you're going to have a local food truck from that community. And there you go. Look at it. We just had a list of them on your screens up there. So. International Credit Union Day, we hear a lot about the differences between the two and the free food, but we also hear about the growth of community choice. You get, I was just at one of your newest branches. Talk about community choice in your footprint here in West Michigan now. Yep, so we have really expanded. Um, we first got into the West Michigan area, I believe about seven years ago. Our first member center was down in Holland. Mm -hmm. uh, we then expanded two years after that in 2017 in the Norton Shores area with a, a little branch off of Estes. And that's actually the team that's moved into the Harvey Street location. Uh, three years ago, two years ago now, sorry, two years ago, October, so two years exactly, we merged physically with First General Credit Union. That's where I came in. That's where our downtown member center came from and our member center down on Ellis Road by the airport. So we really are expanding and growing, and now we have the newest member center, Look which you that. can see on your screen. It's beautiful. Uh, absolutely <laughs> gorgeous, and uh, we'd love it if you stopped in. It's open concept. It's a completely different feel. Uh, you walk in there, you don't feel like you're walking into a traditional bank or credit union. You're walking in feeling like your family, and that's the point of what we're doing here. Kind of looks like a cafe. I mean, it's very warm and welcome, all the wood. I mean, We've got great coffee. So. <laughs> and they've got good coffee. Wait, so for your branch, Courtney and Ethan, were you able to decide which food truck you were going to get? Yeah, so I'm going to be having a, a bunch of different smoky barbecue kind of food yeah. at mine, and I'll let Ethan explain his. Yep, so ours, uh, we found a local downtown business. They just started. It's called Sanders Mobile Shop, mm -hmm. and what they are doing are uh, specialty wraps and wings. So I know which one I'm going for. I'm not on a <laughs> faster a diet, so the wings are coming my way. I love it. You got the wraps, the wings, you got all these great dishes of uh, barbecue, as you heard comfort food for free while well, you learn all about Community Choice Credit Union. Thank you so much for the time this morning, Ethan Thornton. Great to see you. Thank, Thank you. Us. Absolutely.